Hey, what's up, guys? It's Gray here, and uh, today I got an After Effects tutorial for you guys. A little bit something, something a little bit different, and um, trying to show you guys different types of programs and stuff I know. And this tutorial will be on how to use Twitch to create that RGB split. And Twitch is a plugin in After Effects from Video Copilot, and I recently got this plugin, and I've been messing with it. And uh, I found out how to do an RGB split, which is pretty cool for some effects. Um, also, I want to say something is that uh, for people that watch tutorial on speed arts, the best way to learn on and how to be good on whatever you're watching, like a tutorial on Photoshop or Cinema 40, or if you're watching a speed art, the best thing to do is while you're watching the video, pause the video, and then try to react or redo what the person's doing in the video. Something like that. You kind of, you you get like a f like a physical like I don't know how to explain it's kind of hard to explain but it sticks to you and you actually learn a lot more by pausing the video and redoing it then play the video then just do step by step you just learn a lot more that's what I used to do when I first started and I learned a lot by doing that watching speed arts trying to redo the same thing but like just trying to get better and try to see what they do and then you learn like new cool stuff and like hot keys and stuff but yeah that's just a quick tip so let's get started all right first what you're gonna want to do is get a new composition 1280 by 720 if you have PVR 59 uh, 59.94 frames per second uh, the duration would just be 30 seconds click OK and then import a clip file import and I'm just going to use a small clip, so I'll just get 5-man. This Drop it down to the timeline. Make sure it's highlighted. You get this orange or yellow highlight around the timeline. Go to Effect. Go to Video Copilot. Twitch. Once you get that, um, go to Enable. And you could put Slide, which will be this. On. Actually, it's on full and we're down to quarter. Slide light. Uh, what else? This is a bunch of presets, but I'm just use none. All right, so put this to 35. This to three. Enables color. Let's see. It's. I preview this, and this is what you get. It's like this twitch. You see this twitch. That's basically what it is, and you can create an RGB split using this. And uh, let's see, let's mess with the settings. Let's try putting this at two. Let me move this closer to that. It's a bit better. You could also do like color or something. Just mess with all this and you get different type of stuff. Like see you get a different type of twitch or color. You could put blur. Let's see what happens here. You just mess with it, but what I just do is blur um time and light. I mean slide and light is the only ones I use. And that's just to create a twitch, but if you want to do the RGB split. What you're going to need to do is go to operator controls, slide down all the way to where it says slide, and then right here where it says RGB split, oh, let me see, go down to slide, the RGB split, pull this up to 100, then RAM preview that, and that's the RGB split. You could also keyframe it so it only happens when you shoot or whenever you want it this is just a preview and that's basically what RGB split is and yeah it's a really cool effect you can use for edits and whatever that's right there the RGB split um, I don't know if I should show you guys how to keyframe it um, yeah I'll just show you guys how to keyframe this alright what you're gonna wanna do is drop this down effects twitch drop that down and go to like a beginning. Let's see. Let's go to like about right here. Let's say you want it to the twitch to come before the shot. You go to seed and amount. 
drop that to zero. Not the amount, just put this to zero. Oh wait, actually put that back to up to three, sorry. We go back one keyframe, put zero, and go forward one. Go forward a few more. And then like about right here, you take it back to zero. Let me get some random twitches. Hold on, let's see. Let's try and preview this. See, and you get some twitches right there. And then, like that, it won't, uh, the twitches won't go out through the whole video because obviously you don't want random twitches going everywhere. You just want it on certain spots, like an effect, so you could keyframe it. But yeah, that's basically just the tutorial on twitches. And um, if you guys have any other tutorial requests or Anything you guys would like me to do, uh, just post a comment, send me a message. I do know how to use After Effects, Cinema 40, Photoshop, Illustrator. Um, yeah, so I could provide different types of tutorial. Just let me know. Don't forget to comment and rate. And um, let's see, there was something else I wanted to say. Oh, yeah, Twitter, Twitter. I have a Twitter also. Uh, link will be in the description. <laughs> Uh, follow me on Twitter if you guys have one, and I'll be holding contests and giveaways and stuff on the Twitter, so, like, I'll just post, like, a tweet or something, and, like, first person to message me or something will, like, get a free intro or something, I don't know, but, yeah, that's basically it, hope you guys like this tutorial, comment, rate, like I said, uh, follow me on Twitter, and that's about it, so I'll catch you guys later, see ya.